Hey y'all, it's Dementi Caliber here, dipping on some Copenhagen Long Cut Wintergreen. So this is going to be an update video slash product showcase. And um, the update basically is from Friday morning up through next week, I am going to be on vacation. Don't know when I'm coming back home, but don't worry guys, the videos are not going to stop. I actually have me a little helper to help out with the videos. And no, it is not the iPhone, it's actually the uh, tripod. I'm just using the iPhone on the tripod to basically showcase the whole thing and uh, just give you a general idea of what it would look like with my uh, Tribute 5 in the, uh, on the tripod instead of the iPhone, which is not very good uh, representation, but hey, it's what I can do for now. And I am bringing my Xbox One and I did want to talk about this. Um, I'm actually going to be bringing my little 19 inch video with me because, well, well, my 43 inch video is mounted to the wall and uh, well it's kind of too big to take on vacation with me that'd be kind of retarded to take a 43 inch TV with me plus I don't even know where the freaking mounts or the base is for it so there's that and it's going to be a little challenge to myself um, going from a 4k TV down to a 720 TV which actually does 1080 which is kind of odd all in itself but um, it should be a fun little experience. And I will do an update video on um, my experiences going back down to like a 1080p TV. And then I'll do a final video when, every, when I get everything hooked back up and start playing the uh, 4K again. Because I know it's going to it's gonna really mess with me going from like a huge wide angle TV down to like a little small wide angle TV. It's hard to explain. But um, <clears throat> anyways, on to the product. So... My grandmother actually got this for me because I've been looking for a uh, tripod for my phone and then we had um, we had a selfie stick that actually had a removable uh, clamp. And I'll go ahead and take the iPhone out so you can see it. So here's the little clamp and uh, it just basically screws onto the uh, tripod and it works really good. Now this tripod does have a removable head so you can buy other parts for it or whatever. Um, this is actually just a camera tripod like mini tripod but um I can actually use it for my phone and uh this is kind of a pain to put in but um yes you can actually pull it back and lock it and then uh push this and lock it back in place so um talking a little bit about the feet um they actually they do uh adjust so they can bend a little bit but I didn't mess with them. I just left them like this. And it sits perfectly level for the most part. And it's a good little addition. My fan is over there on the floor. Because I usually keep my fan on my TV tray. Or my gaming desk, uh, desktop, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I use this thing for just about everything. From making videos to playing Forza with my wheel. And then... Obviously, using it as a fan stand because it gets hot in my room. But um, back to the product. It uh, it does have a little angle to it. You can actually angle it, and uh, yeah, you can also turn it and clamp it back down. And the clamp actually holds the uh. A little swivel or the little removable head, so you can actually turn a movable head and uh, you can do side shots or whatever you want uh, up and down, landscape, it doesn't matter. You can actually do pretty much anything with this little tripod. Now, it is quite small. Um, I do have a bigger one over like a full size tripod, but it doesn't have the uh, actual boot that slips in, so I had to drill a hole. And it's just, it's a pain in the ass to work with because the screw's missing on it. Now that I actually have this little guy right here, I can actually do more tabletop stuff. I don't have to use this awkward ass tripod. Literally, I drilled a hole into the uh, TV tray because my actual phone holder, it broke. So I'm going to take that off, but I drilled a hole into the TV tray and it's just, it's awkward guys. Like, here, let me show you. Yeah, it's fucking awkward. So, um, I don't have to use this no more. And, uh, it won't be fucking ghetto-fied anymore. So, yeah. 
But, um, there's not really much I can say about the tripod at this moment because I have not used it yet. But, um, it's pretty cool. It's got a neat little color scheme going on, blue and black. And then to match it, I just went ahead and put this, uh, like I said, it's part two, a uh, uh, selfie stick, one of those removable stuff, selfie sticks so you can actually put a camcorder or something on it or like a mini digital camera on it or even a GoPro and uh, you can take pictures that way but um I went ahead and just took it off of there for now being I'm going on vacation now I am taking the green selfie stick with me for like when we have uh, gatherings with our family and we want to take a photo well hey I got a selfie stick so let's do this but um anyways guys that's pretty much all I can say at this moment um, I hope y'all had a wonderful 4th of July. I hope y'all had fun. Y'all stay safe. And I hope y'all didn't shove no firecrackers up your ass because that would be very bad. Or even your mouth, dude. Like, i seen so many videos. I actually fell asleep. 4th of July day. Watching dumbasses shove firecrackers up their nose and have them take firecrackers to the mouth. And it was just, it was fucking stupid. It was just, it's retarded. But, uh... Yeah, I hope you didn't do any of that, guys, because that would be horrible. But um, anyways, guys, this is Demented Caliber signing out.